Why is it that we honor mothers, not just once, but multiple times a year? It's a question that's puzzled many. The answer lies in the history and origins of Mother's Day and Mothering Sunday, two celebrations that, while similar in name and nature, have vastly different roots and traditions. The modern Mother's Day we know today originated in the United States, thanks to the tireless campaign of a woman named Anna Jarvis. After her mother's death in 1905, Anna sought to create a day dedicated to honoring the sacrifices mothers make for their children. Her efforts bore fruit in 1914, when President Woodrow Wilson officially declared the second Sunday of May as Mother's Day. This holiday quickly gained popularity across the United States and eventually spread to other parts of the world. Today, it's celebrated on various dates worldwide, with May being the most common month for these celebrations. It's a day dedicated to expressing love and gratitude towards mothers and maternal figures through gifts and gestures of appreciation. On the other side of the Atlantic, however, another celebration predating modern Mother's Day has been observed for centuries, Mothering Sunday. This holiday has Christian roots and is celebrated on the fourth Sunday of Lent in the United Kingdom and Ireland. Unlike the American Mother's Day, Mothering Sunday was not originally devoted to honoring mothers. Instead, it was a day when people returned to their mother church, the church in their home parish, for a service held on Laetare Sunday. Over time, this religious tradition evolved into a more secular celebration of motherhood, similar to the American Mother's Day. The key difference between these two celebrations lies in their origins and traditions. Mother's Day, born from a campaign to honor mother's sacrifices, is observed on the second Sunday of May in many countries. Mothering Sunday, on the other hand, has religious roots tied to Lent and has morphed over time into a celebration of motherhood. So, why do we celebrate Mother's Day multiple times a year? It's simply because these two holidays, while similar in name and purpose, stem from different cultural and historical contexts. They have evolved separately over time, leading to multiple celebrations of mothers and motherhood throughout the year. In essence, these multiple celebrations underscore the universal importance and significance of mothers in our lives. They provide us with multiple opportunities to express our love and gratitude towards the women who have nurtured, guided and loved us unconditionally. So, whether it's Mother's Day in May or Mothering Sunday during Lent, take the opportunity to honour the incredible mothers and mother figures in your life. After all, can we ever really thank them enough?